four, John. Scores! Kucherov right off the draw, the lightning strike first in game four. The hot hand, Kucherov. I mentioned the face-offs were 56% in favor of Florida in the first period, and right here, Sorelli's gonna battle his back. And he shoves it through his legs on the second try. Watch right here. Does he use his glove? We'll have to have a closer look, but this goes right to Kucherov. Watch right here. Is that his glove? I'm not sure if that's glove. They're gonna have a look at this as well as Kucherov rips this home. And this could be another 10 minutes. Or does he use the shaft? No, it's his glove. That's coming back. We're going to be on zeros again. Let's hope this one doesn't take as long. I think Shirelli knows it too. He knows what he did. Hand pass right there. Pass. You can see, yeah. Which would be the stoppage. Yep. <laughs> We're going to be on zeros again for sure. Oh. This one, you're right though. That'll be quick because that's, that's a clear cut angle of it. And Sorelli. Well, he, he misses yeah. over the top of the first one, and his top hand comes through. And right there, I thought maybe he got it with the middle of his shaft, but he didn't. I think he got it with his glove. I think you'll see his fingers touch it on right his right there. hand. Oh, yeah. Yep. And unfortunately for the fans and the energy of this game, this is really tough when you have two plays go back to back within a matter of minutes as Bobrovsky misses that one, and he's going to get a hat trick of chances to keep his at zero. That's under two minutes apart. Yeah, it, it, just, it just takes a lot yeah. of energy out of the building, and it frustrates the fans and everything, but the importance of something like this, especially for Florida, who's facing elimination, you got to get it right. And unfortunately, I think everybody knows that's off the glove. And I knew he took a second, a second swipe, but we couldn't tell till the second highlight whether or not it was the shaft of the stick or it was his glove, yeah. So once again, Chris Lee, Steve Kazari, back of the headsets with the Situation Room in Toronto. And Andrew Burnett in a Game 1 challenge that he tried in Game 1 and failed for interference, but he won this one with the puck going off the netting. And Huberdeau's reaction, I mean, is so instantaneous, right? And there's the swipe, and then boom, the glove pushes it back. And I'm, I, I'm you know, certain this one's coming back. I mean, there's just no way. Yeah, minute 48 seconds later, and this one. And they're already off the headset, so this one much faster. And once again, here's Steve Pizzari. After review, the puck was glove hand pass to his player. Therefore, we have a missed stoppage, no goal. 